What's going on, guys? I can't stop smiling at the moment because I just watched about a half an hour ago the second trailer for Batman v Superman: Dawn of Justice. <laughs> Holy shit! Oh my god! I want to give you my quick review of the trailer before I start to like gush like a nerdy little fanboy, the one that I am. And um, you know. We see at the beginning Clark Kent and Bruce Wayne interacting with one another uh, out of costume. And Batman being the world's greatest detective, you know by Affleck's demeanor in that scene that he knows that Clark Kent is Superman. And I think that maybe there was an inkling that uh, Lex Luthor might know too. I mean, it's not hard to tell. I mean, classes, come on. Uh, because it was uh, implied at the end of the at Man of Steel that... Uh, both lane you but I mean that was great nice mention of the Joker I'm sick of chasing clowns and funny costumes around and then all of a sudden Lex Luthor Lex Luthor comes into frame and um, he's a clown in a funny costume because of all the fan backlash as to how Jesse Eisenberg's character is dressed uh, in the stills that have been previously released but I mean Oh my god, and I think Jesse Eisenberg is going to kill it. I knew he was going to kill it from the beginning, man. The kid's a great actor. And when they casted him, I just immediately thought of the social network. Like, in the social network, as Zuckerberg, like, he's like a villain. Like, he's sitting there at that uh, court hearing with Eduardo Sabrin or whatever, and he's sitting there and he's doodling and he's cocky and he's talking shit and he's saying like, you know, that my employees at Facebook are over there doing things that nobody in this room is capable of. And if I wanted to right now, I could use a small percentage of the money that I've gained from Facebook and I could turn this entire building into my own personal ping pong room. That is Lex Luthor. So like, I mean, that's perfect. And I think that uh, after this trailer, the haters are going to be eating their words for sure. But uh, I, and I also I feel like Zack Snyder saw the trailer for Civil War and he's like, oh shit, that was awesome. We gotta up the ante. Fuck it, throw Doomsday in there. Put him in there. You know, let's let's officially confirm that Doomsday is gonna be a part of the movie, and uh, <laughs> let's throw him in there. And they did. It was awesome. And I just you know to see the holy trinity of superheroes standing together, uh, ready to fight together, was totally dope, and it blew my mind. And I was you know. Like I said, like I know a lot of people are passionate about Star Wars. You know, my passion lies with the guys in tights who've been running around fighting bad guys and, you know, all that stuff. Um, and I'm excited for Star Wars. I love Star Wars. But I'll tell you what, man. Uh, between Civil War and Batman v Superman and Deadpool, I just want to get Star Wars the fuck over with so I can see those movies. Uh... But anyway, uh, this trailer confirms that Batman and Superman indeed kiss and make up at some point because when Doomsday comes into the picture, they do uh, join forces with Wonder Woman and they have to fight him. And it looks like another city is going to get decimated, uh, whether it be Gotham or uh, Metropolis. And I'm, I'm interested to see how that all plays out. Uh, the events of Batman v Superman all play out and affect Suicide Squad. But I mean, fuck, this trailer blew my mind, man. It was crazy. It was so good to see all the business. So many great one-liners and quotes in these past two trailers that we've seen for the movie. That it, it just, oh, they're so great. And a lot of them with Lex Luthor, and like I said, the haters got to be eating their words, man. I think Jesse Eisenberg is absolutely gonna kill it. And uh, you know, this trailer revealed a shit ton. And man, am I excited for it? Like I, I. I I watched the trailer and freaked out. My roommate was actually in here when I, about 45 minutes ago when I initially watched it for the first time, and he saw my reaction. He just started laughing because he, he, he kind of gets it, but he doesn't get it. Um, I, I've introduced him to the superhero film genre, and he appreciates it a little more than he, he does. He's, he's not a big comic book reader, but you know, he's seen all the movies, and he's actually watched a lot of the... TV shows and stuff, but I don't want to get into that shit. We're talking about Batman and Superman, and holy shit on a shingle! I don't even know what to say. I, I don't. I, uh, I, uh, <laughs> uh, I think Batflex gonna kill it. There he is right now. He's over here. If he wants to come say hi and say what he thought of the trailer, he saw it. Tell him what you think. He said of the trailer.
Who am I talking to? You're talking to YouTube, man. To YouTube? Yeah. I thought the trailer was pretty dope. That's right. It was pretty awesome. But I'm, I'm excited. About. I'm extremely excited. I and want Batman to kick Superman's ass. As he should. Mm -hmm. And uh, that's what I want to see. And then they make up after that. But first, Superman gets a bad suit. That's right. There we go. And then Batman's voice in his normal costume seems like it's kind of modulated, um, which interested me. I'm intrigued to see how they kind of play that out, explain that, and that was kind of cool. But I just, uh, God, man, I, I, I'm, a I'm at a loss for words. The trailer fucking blew my mind. Like, as soon as I thought the Civil War trailer was amazing, this, <laughs> uh, I think Zack Snyder wins this round. But, um, that's pretty much all I have to say. I have a lot of homework to do. I wanted to make a video. I wanted to make a, a, a you know, let you guys know what I thought and give my thoughts on it. Um, I'm still kind of, like, coming down from the high that I got off of that trailer, so my thoughts might not be that coherent, but, you know, <laughs> whatever. But let me know what you guys thought. Uh, let me know if you liked it. Uh, let me know your thoughts on everything like that. Uh, leave a comment, like the video, subscribe, please. Show me some support. Um, but anyway, uh, I'll see you guys next time. Cheers. I had to have a glass of wine after I watched that trailer. That's right, I had to. I didn't have any beer, but my roommate, she had wine. So I, I had to drink something. But anyway, I got homework. I'll see you guys later.